quite simply, it doesn't get any more pressure packed than this. The decisive game at the Euros with everything on the line. Which country will be crowned champions of Europe? It's going to be fascinating finding out. Will it happen live on EA TV? And so it comes down to this. Welcome to our coverage of the final here at the Euros. My name is Derek Ray, sitting here on the commentary gantry. And with me to provide expert analysis, a complete tactical breakdown, is Stuart Robson. What a match this promises to be. It's Portugal versus Germany. Well, there's going to be some nerves out there for sure, but what an occasion this should be. It's going to be tense, it's going to be tight, but it's also going to be dramatic. It should be a terrific game. Bruno Fernandes. Can they keep it out? What a genuine opportunity, but it was squandered. Goal kick. Well, the 2016 European champions back in the final. No great surprise that Portugal are here. We've enjoyed their football over the course of the last few weeks and intriguing to see if they can get over the line on this, the biggest occasion of them all. And the good thing about Portugal is they do have different game plans. If they want to in this game... Oh, the chance is on, Stuart. And that's an excellent piece of defending to thwart him. You know, when Ronaldo is on the pitch, we tend to think he'll stamp his authority on the game, Stuart. What in particular do you expect to see from him this time around? Well, Derek, we know he can score goals in many different ways, but I think he's at his most dangerous when he's running with the ball and hitting his shots with power. It's almost unstoppable for the goalkeeper. That's what makes him a great finisher. Toni Kroos. Germany pushing forward with options available. But they took care of the situation defensively. Bernardo Silva. And the penalty is given. The referee right on the spot. And now a chance for them to take the lead here. Well, he's avoided a booking, but the complaints continue. And I can understand why. I think it's a poor foul. It should be a yellow card for me. This to open the scoring here. And a goal! He was composure personified, and he's done his job from the spot. Well, as you can see, the keeper makes no effort in the end. He was hoping it would be struck down the middle, but it's an easy finish, really. So underway again here, one nil to score. Musiala. Decent position for Germany to be in. It was on its way in. Intelligent threaded pass here. Ronaldo! And a goal! I'll tell you what, they're going to be very hard to catch now. Name on the trophy, maybe. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions. And this is Ronaldo at his best. He's composed, he shows great technique, and he just smashes it beyond the keeper. So back underway with the scoreline standing at 2-0. Florian Wirtz. Good move in the making from Germany, but the danger averted for now. Well, Portugal might be onto something. 
Ronaldo able to get his body in the way. Kai Havertz. This is Kroos. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. Gundogan. This is Kroos. Andri. Kai Havertz. Determined defending. And Portugal exploiting the space on the flank. Ronaldo! And that's the hat-trick! Tearing apart this defence time and again. They simply can't handle him. Well, this is worth seeing again. Just look how Ronaldo goes beyond his man. And Ronaldo's shot is then hit with such power. He's a top-class player when he gets into those areas. So the action continues, and Portugal very much bossing the proceedings here. And a free kick awarded by the referee. Jamal Musiala. Oh, breezing past him. What a save! And short it is. Throw in then for Germany. Beards. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. And he's keen on cutting in. Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. Well, maybe a good position from which to counter. the easiest of saves but you'd expect him to stop it and a long way out still could be dangerous and a time for cool heads Jamal Musiala on the ball Rudiger Joshua Kimmich Musiala. Perfect challenge. Pepe. Well, not giving him any breathing room. Well, a swift challenge and a throw in coming up. Musiala. That'll be a Germany throw. Wirtz. On the ball, Rüdiger. Gundogan. Well, he didn't miss by an awful lot. Bernardo Silva. We've had the official word. There will be a minimum of two added minutes. Maximilian Mittelstädt. A space for Germany in the wide area. Musiala. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. So, back in business. Germany's difficulties there for all to see in the first half. How do they respond now? And he 
they stopped them in their tracks. The referee correctly decided to play advantage. A oh, nice ball over the top. And that is offside. Well, play was allowed to carry on, but now that it's come to a halt, a caution. Well, good run, this. Now, what can he do with it? He's taken on his opponent here. Well, defending always has to be a team effort. Good piece of covering. And Portugal showing good wins. Real chance. And this time it's in. Fabulous goal. And just look at the celebrations. Well, let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick. And then the shot could not be hit any better. Struck with such venom. Great goal. And this is turning into something of a rout. 4-0. And he. Jonathan Tarr has it. Clean challenge. And Germany get the throw. Tony Kroos. He's beaten his man. Gundogan. Wasteful from Germany. Ronaldo. Ronaldo. Superbly read and executed. Ronaldo. Well, as you can see, this is a wonderful strike. He makes the perfect connection, and he has so much pace on it. It's a great goal. So, half an hour remaining. Kimi. Good use of advantage. And Portugal regaining possession. Bruno Fernandes has it. A real opening now. Well, that's a moment he'd like to airbrush from history. Not a good attempt. Well, lots of power, but no control whatsoever. That's a real waste. Gundogan. Andy. This is Kroos. David Raum. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. Gundogan. Oh, it could be an opportunity here. And nicely parried away. Bruno Fernandes has it. Well, they might be able to launch a counter-attack. Tony Kroos. Well, a good tackle. That's useful play. Big chance. Oh, magnificent from the keeper. Fantastic stop. And time for the change now. Ottavio. Ronaldo. Just failing to hit the target. Good effort, though. 
Well, Derek, this has been a really good performance, as you can see. They've created numerous chances, they're winning the game comfortably, and they could go on and score more. This could get really embarrassing. Havertz. Difficult to stop him. Well, didn't go as a plan in the end. Fairly easy for the referee to spot that deflection. So now a throw in. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. And does well to keep it in play. Not the pass he had in mind. Pascal Gross. Kai Havertz. Oh, this is looking promising. Well, they just couldn't make it happen. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. Ten minutes to go. Palinha. Now with Silva. Chance to run at them. Fernand in position. And there is the goal. He's found the net. Joy unconfined. Well, as you can see, what an excellent back heel this is to set up the goal. And Ronaldo finishes it with so much quality. Just look how much power he hits this with. It's a top-class goal. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Will he find the net? Well, the bar can be the goalkeeper's best friend. Well, able to survive that attacking push. Germany have possession once more. Has eyes for goal! Well, the keeper kept it out with a minimum of fuss, but it wasn't a great effort. Well, that'll be a free kick. Well, three minutes of stoppage time, that's what the officials have said. Bruno Fernandes, nicely timed tackle. Might be a chance here. He can't hold on to it. And there goes the final whistle. Portugal have won the Euros on this dramatic night here in Berlin. The joy, the ecstasy, also the disappointment, but ultimately the feeling of togetherness. Well, I have to say, they've been brilliant throughout the tournament. They were great today as well. They are the deserved champions, no doubt about that. And these are very special scenes that we're witnessing. And now with the pressure off, a chance to reflect, a chance to celebrate, the trophy about to be presented. The European champions, Portugal! What a great moment for these players, absolutely brilliant.
And it doesn't get any better than this, does it? A chance now to celebrate with their own fans. And the fans have also played their part. Just listen to the noise here. Great end to this tournament.